Hi, hello, it's Anne. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a brand new bullet journal setup video. Today I'm setting up my bullet journal for the month of March 2021 and I decided to go with this astronaut like spacey theme. And um, I wanted to do something that was kind of like seasonal to March. But if you know anything about Sweden in March, you know that it's pretty darn gray. And I wanted to do uh, something very colorful, just to kind of like spruce things up a little bit. Um, and the obvious choice would be St. Patty's Day, but that's not something that I celebrate. And it's not really anything that I like connect with. So I didn't want to do St. Patty's Day. And um, so I ended up Googling like historical events in March. And, and it turns out that in March 1965, Soviet cosmonaut Alexei Leonov I'm probably butchering that name, but he made the first ever spacewalk in history. So I thought that this was a fun theme to try out and also a little bit of a history lesson for y'all. So yeah, so I decided to go with this like cartoony astronaut just floating in space for the cover page. And I also added in a little quote which says curiosity is the essence of our existence because I feel like that was very fitting with the whole space exploration theme. So um, yeah, and then I just added some teeny tiny planet doodles at the bottom right there and to decorate this this whole setup i am using my watercolors and i'm also using my fine tech watercolors which is the gold ones which is super sparkly and to kind of section off these different bits that i want painted because i'm gonna be doing like a galaxy th thing and making straight edges while trying to blend colors is pretty much impossible so i decided to tape off the sections that i wanted painted and to do so i'm just using washi tape that i know i'm probably never gonna use for anything else so <laughs> i'm using my least favorite washi tapes for for just sectioning off and masking the edges Okay, I have something very, very exciting to share with you guys. I actually, today, I launched my Patreon page, which is, <laughs> what? Um, a, a few of you guys have been asking me to do either a online shop or a Patreon where you can access digital downloads of all of my setups. So, so I, I made that happen and I'm, I'm very nervous, but also very excited. <laughs> Um, so yeah, this is pretty much like a soft launch. I'm gonna make an actual, hey, I'm on Patreon video, but, um, as for now, I'm just sitting here in my sweatpants and my hair is an absolute mess and I, I'm, I'm not camera ready, so that's not happening today. So I'm kind of doing a little bit of a soft launch and I'm only telling you guys here and I'll probably make like a little Instagram story about it, but, um, yeah. That's that's very exciting. I'll I spoke to you guys a little bit about this in a previous video. I don't remember which one. Um, but what I'm doing is I am starting off with only digital rewards as kind of like just seeing how things go kind of situation, you know. Um, and as soon as I feel like I'm kind of getting the hang of things, I'm going to be getting myself a P.O. box. And at that point, I'm also going to be um, able to add physical rewards. So I'm going to have some stickers. I'm going to have postcards and exclusive little goodie bags. And I'm even considering doing like a monthly little polymer clay charm thing for like a limited amount of people so um yeah i'm very excited about all of those things but um as a, a, again um i'm starting off with digital only so i'll have um i'll have some wallpapers both for your desktop and for your phone background and i'll also have a cheaper option for like a digital sticker download where you get kind of like the accents of the month 
and then I'll also have a full digital download as well as other perks. So if you want to be part of that, um, you know, head on over to my Patreon and if you don't want to be part of that, that's also totally cool. I still love y'all and I don't want anyone to feel pressured to, to join my Patreon. This is just for the ones of you that has been asking for it and are able and willing to do so. But I don't want anyone to feel pressured to join because that's not what it's there for. So um, I just want you guys to know that your support means the absolute world to me, whether you're able to support me on patreon or if it's just watching this video and commenting and subscribing and liking that's that's all i could ever ask for is just your attention and you being here so thank you so much for for just being here i i truly truly appreciate each and every single one of you Okay, we are quite far into the setup at this point. I've been rambling on for quite some bit as per usual. And uh, we've we've set up a few pages already. So right now I'm working on my this month's section, which is pretty much like a combination of my monthly focus, my gratitude log, my um, weekly and monthly action items, which is kind of working um, together with my annual goals and also my hours worked section um, where I just keep track of the hours that I work. Duh. And uh, <laughs> And uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. This is just a very compressed way to compile it all, and I love it. And you're you'll probably also notice that I did not include habit trackers this month, and that is because they're gonna show up a little bit later for the weekly spreads. And I'm doing this kind of Dutch door situation, so hang tight for that. But before then, we are setting up my budget and expenses spread. And this is the same as I've been doing for the, the rest of this year, which is the left hand page where I have my daily, you know, uh, incomes and, and expenses. And this is categorized by income, it's uh, entertainment, health and fitness, miscellaneous, transportation, household, i.e. like food and, and whatnot. Um, I have debts and savings. And on the right hand page, I have my budget envelope system. And if you want to know exactly how I utilize this, I say this in every, <laughs> every video where I show this. But I have a video where I take you through step by step exactly how I use this throughout the month along with a bunch of other economy and finance spreads. So if you're interested in knowing exactly how I use this, make sure to check that out i'll link it up above in the little information card as well as the description box down below okay so here we go with the habits um my weekly setup is one that i keep coming back to i think i started doing this this type of setup uh, with some alterations of course back in july i want to say was the first time i did this and i keep coming back to it so um you know there i i can't pinpoint what it is i think it's just so simple that's why i love it there are no funny business there's nothing that's like making it like complicated for no reason it's just like straightforward like straight to the point no fuss and it's just very simple and um, easy to use and to set up so i think that's why i love it so much <laughs> Um, but basically, I just have a section for each and every one of the days. I just end up um, sectioning off the page into four different sections. So each spread is eight sections. So each one of the day has a, a quarter of a page of its own. And then the last quarter um, is just a this week section where I have kind of a weekly to-do list. Um, the alterations that I made this month is that I made it like a Dutch door situation because I thought that I wasn't gonna use all of the space. You see, when I started using this setup, I was using an A5 journal and now I'm using a B5 journal which gives me a lot more space and I don't think I would have used all of that space, especially 
like width wise lengthwise sure but like horizontal wise no um so what i ended up doing was i just cut off a little section so that on the right hand page i have my habits for the month so i'm hoping this is gonna make me like actually fill my habits out because it's gonna be like right there when i'm using my weekly spreads which is my my most used spread that i look at every single day and um then on the right hand page i have just a running task list for the month and and that's that's pretty much it it's very simple and i hope it's gonna be just as efficient and easy to use as i'm I'm hoping is gonna be. Um, so yeah, that's my March setup. Um, pretty much everything that I have to show you guys. So here is a final flip through. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe if you have not done so. And you know, again, my Patreon page is live. So if you want a printable of this entire setup, check out my patreon and shortly there will be a digital download of this entire setup so yeah thank you so so much for watching i hope you're having a lovely day or night or evening or whatever it is as you are watching this and i will see you guys in my next video thank you so so much for watching and happy planning bye